the classic handicap chases next thing this is a grade three handicap over three miles and five furlongs at the top we've got dawn of the new age joshua southern nashville ortega vinnie gerard truckers darling john morgan banks of the nile Leon Van Rensburg, Bryce Norton, Darren Thompson, R. Ben, David Hooley, Annie Oakley, John Morgan, Bucko, Martin Lidham, Cozy Breda, David Robertson, Boomerang Amar, Graham Clitterbuck, Sal's Beauty, David Hooley, Enroller, Obi-Wan, Chrysalis Future and Compact Bonnie for James Shea, Anaheim, Paul Rhodes, Maritza, Thomas Rogers and Interim Mount, David Robertson. So, 17 then this time. Facing the starter in the rain. One of the biggest races of the season, and away they go. In the shadow of the post. With a couple of circuits ahead of them. Pulling for his head, Anaheim looks like he wants to go on into the lead. Jockey's not keen on letting it go too quickly, and he's got two John Morgan front runners for company as well. And the pace is surprisingly pedestrian at this point, with Anaheim wanting to lead and John Morgan in two up in the front. Three or four, you would expect the pace to be pretty hot, but it isn't. And Anaheim has now settled down into the lead and has gone five clear. Of Annie Oakley in second. And then Dawn of the New Age and Truckers Darling. And with Chrysalis Future in Roller, then R. Ben. And Nashville Ortega. The field are pretty tightly packed though, with the exception of this leader, as they finally get to the first of the 20 fences. And they're all safely over that with Bucko, who was second or third in this last year. At the back, but it's Anaheim in the lead. A good six clear of Annie Oakley on the inside of Dawn of the New Age, and then Truckers Darn is fourth. Chrysalis Future is fifth, and Roller is close up in sixth. But behind that one, Nashville Ortega, and then Banks of the Nile. Pull away and then we pull back in again. Come around with a little bit of a fiddle around as they get to number two. And they're all safely over number two, although Sal's beauty was a bit slow at the back. And we've had three or four back markers, but only one leader so far as they get over the third, and they're all safely over the third with Anaheim clear in front. And the Oakley is second. Dawn of the New Age is third. Truckers down in fourth and in roller fifth as they get to the fourth. The old stream. Oh, there's a fall there. It's Bucko's gone. So the local horse placed last year is not going to do that. This year he's out of the classic chase as they get over number five. And groans from the stand as the local horse departs. But it's Anaheim in front from Annie Oakley second. And all of the new agent in roller as they get to the sixth. And they're all safely over that one. We've just Bucko departed so far. And I'm clear in front. Well, Annie Oakley second in roller is now third. And then Dawn of the New Age. And Trucker's Darling to meant is getting much closer as well in those purple and maroon hoops. To the north of Leon Van Rinberg creeping around the outside as they get over number seven. Looks like all safely over and towards the back. Sal's Beauty still the back marker with compact Bonnie for company. But it's Anaheim in the lead. Over fence eight, which they all get over nicely. Anaheim's lead is down to just two lengths now. Annie Oakley second, entry mount third, in roller fourth. As they get to the ninth. Safely over the ninth as well. All jumping well. The exception of the departed Bucko. But it's Anaheim in front. Pops over number 10. Roman Roller is now much closer in second. That's the big screen past the winning post. And then out for one more circuit of the track. Anaheim in front, and Roller is second, and Dora the New Age is third, and Trim Mount is four, and Chrysalis Future is five, then Annie Oakley and Truckers Darling, the John Morgan pair have dropped back a little bit, and another great cosy braid, and then Maritza on the inside of that one with Boomerang and Marn, and then Bryce Norton and Nashville Ortega, the Punks of the Nile, and R. Ben, and then finally Sal's Beauty and Compact Bonnie 
is the back marker and the horns then all the way so far and it's too clear so get over the 11th which is also for the other Racing down towards the 12th then now. Anaheim still in the lead. And daughter of the new age second. And roll of third. Truck is darling fourth, entering map fifth. And the Oakley trying to get back into it on the inside. One or two of these might be struggling for racing room soon if they don't watch it. They could easily get boxed in. If they can get to the 12th. And Anaheim jumping well today in the lead. Compact Bonnie made a mistake at the back. Still going well in second as I take this ditch. Good jump by a roller. <coughs> I've seen him get up to within a length of the leader. But it's at a high new leads. To a roller second. At the 14th, and then mistake there by Anaheim. And there's a faller at the back. Cozy Braid is gone. So Cozy Braid is out of it. And then Roller hits the front as Anaheim made the mistake. But look at this back to the nine on the outside. Cruising into it as they get over the 15th. Mistake there was by Boomerang and Marn. And the two of these now being caught out as the pace quickens. But well, Anaheim's got back into the lead. And Roller is second. Banks and nine looks to be absolutely cruising. So too does Bryce Norton who's come through into fourth. Then comes our Ben and Dawn of the New Age. And Truckers Darling and Boomerang and Man trying to get back into it as well. But it's four a line now. And the two on the outside look to be going the best. Bryce Norton and Banks of the Nile. From Anaheim, who's now beginning to drop away. And Roller is still there and now fighting back for the lead. Also, Sal's Beauty's come from absolutely nowhere out the back to come through to challenge now as well. Over the 17th they go. And it's Banks of the Nile in the lead from Sal's Beauty second. Bryce Norton is third in Roller fourth. Then comes Boomerang and Mine. Our Ben's running on. He's surely between these. Dawn of the New Age is trying to get back into it. But over the third last they go. And it's Banks of the Nile who's in the lead from Sal's Beauty in second. In Roller's third, Bryce Norton didn't find a lot when it came down to it. He's now labouring back in fourth over the second last they go and it's dawn of the new age in the lead interim mount is now coming through with a late challenge but it's dawn of the, it's banks of the nine in the lead banks of the nine by a length and a half over the final fence lands in the lead better jump by sal's beauty chrysalis future and compact body have both gone at the back race banks of the nine racing out towards the line banks of the nine's holding on sal's beauty's trying to close and sal's beauty is getting up to win it sal's beauty takes it Sat out the back for a long way, that one. And then came through to take it. Short running again, remember. And the jockey on Banks the Knob didn't look to be working that hard. And maybe some questions need to be asked about that. But Sal's Beauty takes it for David Hooley. Banks of the Nile for Elva Rensburg second. Bryce Norton, Darren Thompson third. Interim Matt for David Rawson fourth. And in roller for Obi Wan was fifth. Stu's going to take over now and take you through the final race of the day. <laughs>